Hi, welcome to this tutorial and welcome to Archmers Mate. We have now a new menu that we've loaded up and that's with it uh, to panel, then menu and the brisk menu. The brisk money menu is coming from Solus. Now, the best way to go, and I'll show you anyway, but it's not helping us with the icon. But the deconf editor is interesting always to have a look and check it out. So I believe it was in org and in where was it again? Well, we took, we can go for brisk because it's called the brisk menu and see if it pops up, but we should go up here and then like so brisk. So the brisk menu comes from Solus projects, as you can see, brisk menu. I've went into this uh, last time and I, I took for uh, went for a dark theme, so we can click here. Label visible or not visible, that's uh, up to you. I can't change uh, the name or can we? Label text. We can change it if we want to. Let's say it right out. So arch merged mate. Let me just confirm. So okay, Eric, we can do that. So, but that's that's the only thing. These these are the settings. That's it. If you want to search at the top or at the bottom, you can do so by just clicking here and then say there and there and there. Okay. So the top is is okay for me. Default at this point in time. This already opening going over everything is also a setting which is roll over activate. So I activated that prior. So I, I found this and I said, no, interesting to change the menu, but where is the icon? So it's not defined here and we defined it in this menu here. We defined it indeed in the deconf editor. So no, not here. If you want to change this icon up here, we need to go to the home folder and then go to the icons um, let's first decide on a icon, meaning um, we should know, let's go via this way, let's go to all icons are accounted for, great, appearance, customize, and decide what we take. So yes, we take Sardi, okay? All right, we have the Sardi icon, then I should go into the Sardi folder. So that's this one. Now I need to be in control meaning I need to be able to delete and create things I cannot there is no way to for me to enter here so I'll go into open terminal I say you know what open me kaha sudo kaha all right meaning I'm opening it again but this time as a boss big boss no I don't need this anymore and I don't need I do need this one because I launched Kaha with this, so I'm going to put this on the right screen. And now we're going to user share icons. That's where all the icons are. Just start typing icons down here. And we decided to change the Sardi icon. This is the icon we want to change. Scalable, places, there are two names you need to remember. Start here is one of them. And start here is symbolic. So they are both the same. But if I decide, we decide, you decide to change any of the others, you can do so just by changing the name. Meaning, this was the original. So maybe write original behind it or something. So don't delete it, keep it. But now you need to rename one of these you like. Maybe a Star Trek. I can start here symbolic Star Trek, why not? Anything goes except the ones that are the really circular ones. It really needs to be a small symbolic icon. So one of those. So start here symbolic, like so. So that's the one here, that's the one there. Everything is okay. We double check, no typos. Start here symbolic, all right. Then we need to go back to the control center and tell the system to switch between one and the other. Aha, but wait, Derek. First, make sure the icon theme cache is deleted. Delete the icon theme cache because that keeps the old icon is in there. 
and we want to get rid of it. And here, oh, whoa, whoa, it's already there. So since I deleted this icon cache, it's already gone. But normally, I always go to customize and then icons and switch from one to the other. So just to be sure that the new icons are coming. As you can see, since Sardi rules all the icons, it's in here, in here, in here, in here, in here. Here is a specific one, Sardi Evo Pop. So that's coming from the Evo Pop combined with Sardi. So he has its own, but most of them changed with it as well. Evo Pop again. So of course, that's the best place to change it. One place to change and to rule them all. It's like the ring, you know, one ring to rule them all. So that's how you change it. And um, if you want to, you can make a new cre uh, icon cache theme, not necessary. Linux can live without it. But if you want to, open in terminal and you type again, create icon theme cache dos sh and the cache file is created successfully, meaning you have got this thing here. I do remember that it was not um, already, it was not executable. Well, it's just schmot plus x, meaning add execute to the create and then that's it. And we have now ls minus l. We have now an x here. So this one got now x's everywhere. Everybody can execute the users, the group and the others. So that's that. Um, now you have your own icon and enjoy.